Stella Harwood lives with her husband in a neat terraced house in Cheltenham. She's now a postwoman, and some of her duties include sorting. And goodness knows she gets enough practice at that at home, because home is crammed floor to ceiling with the stuff you and I, our parents and grandparents, have simply regarded as litter. The throwaway debris of 20th century life includes enough comics and shilling pop magazines to revive the memory of growing pains. Ouch. But wait till you see Stella Cellar. Dad's army would be at home here. Anyone remember National Dried Milk? And what was his line, I wonder? Um, this is one of my favorite um, objects, I suppose. It's a, it's a hot water bottle, I assume, in the shape, very much shape, of Rita Hayworth, probably late 50s perhaps early 60s. That's one of the old Robertson's gollies. This particular one would have been seen in a grocer's shop probably during the 40s and 50s. And it's precisely this throwaway quality which attracts Stella. Well, that's, that's the very thing about them which is important. I mean, um, the things that appear on people's breakfast tables, the things that are in, in the, the glove compartments of their cars, these are the things that you hardly notice and yet you live with them. Well, I'd wager more than a roll of Everest billed here as the peak of toilet paper perfection that some will regret having thrown this little lot away. The Eagle's very own Dandare projector kit, a Guinness lampshade with 1930s toucan, probably now worth a hundred pounds. A wartime baby doll equipped bizarrely with wartime baby's gas mask. And look what your granny had to vacuum with. Of course, in, in ten years' time, things from the 80s will become interesting, and I'll, I'll wish I hadn't thrown everything away. Do you think there's a, a story behind some of these? Well, um, the things that you used to see in sweet shops when you were, when there were corner sweet shops, of course, they're disappearing now, unfortunately. The things that you used to see in shop windows, the toys that you always wanted for Christmas, but you could never have, because you couldn't have everything. And the rest of us can't have this either, a magnificent AMI jukebox, vintage early 60s. Even the records have authentic surface noise. Every night I sit here by my window, You'll have to open a museum soon. Yeah, my, uh, my whole sort of reason for living, this is what I want to do in the future, is, is get some sort of premises and uh, open a museum so that other people can come and have a laugh or remember. Like a walk in the park, like a kiss in the dark, like a sailboat ride, what about the night we cry? 